Annyeong Suppers. Thank you for joining us at today's stop. This time, we will be talking about our top 10 Korean couples that moved their love from the filming set to real life. Let us know in the comments which K-drama couple is your favorite. Here we go. It's not uncommon for people who have such a controlled life and a tight agenda to find love in the most unexpected places. After sharing some time pretending to love each other, love can easily bloom when handsome actors and actresses look into each other's eyes with such a strong passion. It makes you automatically fall for them. Who wouldn't love Song Kang or Chao Nu looking into your eyes with that strong passion in person? I know you've fallen for them too. It's no difference for the following couples. While they not necessarily met on set, the drama that brought them together made us look into their prospect future as a couple and made us fall in love with their screen love. Also share the connection off screen. Find them now. Ten, Lee Hye Ri and Ryu Jong Jo. After staring together 2015's drama Reply 1988 and each other's love interest for a while, it was inevitable for this couple not to fall in love with each other. Sharing looks and treasuring moments that will make them come back to the recording moment and think back, why didn't I make her fall for me? Even when they didn't end up together in the drama, it was not the case in real life. They confirmed their dating status in 2017 two years after the drama aired, and were able to live their in-screen romance in real life. Being named the power couple was not easy for these actors. This couple recently broke up after seven confirmed years of dating, now keeping only a professional relationship and the promise to support each other. They left us with amazing moments to rewatch whenever we're feeling like watching a TBT. Both actors have been mainly focused on their careers, with John Yeo appearing on Alienoid Part 2, and here he will be back with the film Victory. 9. Nam Joo Hyuk and Lee Song Hyun While these two actors already met years before the filming of the K-drama Weightlifting Fairy Kim Bok Jo, as they worked together in the modeling business, and given the fact that they were both signed up in the same agency and with the same career path, their love bloomed in the filming set. After the drama aired, due to the strong connection they both shared and the public sighting of the couple fueled the rumors of a romance and love. Their agency confirmed they were dating in 2017, But four months after, they confirmed their relationship ended. They have stayed as close and supporting friends. Such support brought conversations of them coming back together back in 2022. But we never know. Probably we will see them together and sharing a little bit of love. 8. Ahn Jae-hyun and Koo Hye-sun These two amazing actors were known for playing roles in huge dramas like Boys Over Flowers and Cinderella in the Four Nights. They met while filming the drama Blood, where both played the lead roles. Their chemistry was undoubtable in the drama. While he was thirsting for her blood, offset he was thirsting for her heart. The relationship was made public as they often shared images of themselves side by side, showing us moments from their dates, travels, and casual time spent at home. Their fans loved this place into their romantic life, often remarking the evident joy and contentment they radiated together. It was not a surprise to many when they announced their marriage as a result of their never-ending love in the set of blood. The love didn't last long. They were experiencing issues after a while and a bunch of messages between them was leaked, giving us glimpses that there was not a paradise anymore at home. They were married since 2016 until 2019. After that, Jaehyun's latest drama was The Real Has Come and he soon has not acted but has been focused on her career as a director and a screenwriter. 7. Lee Min-ho and Park Mi-young The famous actor Lee Min-ho, also known as Goo Yeon-pyo from the famous drama Boys Over Flowers, and Park Mi-young, known for roles in Love King Contract and Marry My Husband. These two actors met as they were playing lead roles in the drama City Hunter. We all know we have a crush on Lee Min-ho. It was no difference for Park Mi-young. Both actors let the world know that they were in a relationship right after the show ended in 2011. One of the most challenging steps in the show business when you have a new relationship and are as booked as Park Mi-young or Lee Min-ho is the schedule. Even when you're in love, if you love what you do the way they do acting, it's complicated to maintain a relationship for a long time. Sadly, the couple call it quits a year later due to their conflicting schedules. 6. Lee Jung-gi and Jeon Hye-bin Lee Jung-gi and Jeon Hye-bin first met on the set of the historical drama Gunmen in Hoseon in 2014. 
their on-screen chemistry soon translated into real-life romance, with the couple officially announcing their relationship in April 2017, after dating for about a year. However, their love story was short-lived, as busy schedules eventually led to their breakup in August of the same year. Despite their affection for each other, the demands of their respective career proved too challenging to sustain their relationship. Lee Jung Gilead's work is Arthur Chronicles, and Young Hye Bin was a short cameo on Kiss Six Sense as one of the fishing couple. She's happily married with a non celebrity, and they welcome their first kid together. Five, Song Joon Ki and Song Hye Kyo. Song Joon Ki and Song Hye Kyo, famous for their roles in hit dramas like Descendants of the Sun and Vincenzo, captivated audiences both on and off the screen. Their on screen chemistry was palpable particularly in Descendants of the Sun, where they portrayed a couple amidst the backdrop of a war-torn country. Fans eagerly awaited confirmation of their off-screen relationship, which was finally confirmed in 2017, followed by a grand wedding ceremony in Seoul. However, their fairy tale of romance came to unexpected end in 2019, when they announced their divorce, citing incompatible differences. By their separation, both actors remain as busy as ever with their careers. Song Joong Ki is happily married to Katie Louise Sanders since 2023, and they've conceived their first child together. Four, Kim Boon and Moon Kyung Young. Kim Boon and Moon Kyung Young, two valued actors known for their remarkable performances in iconic dramas like *Boys Over Flowers* and *Cinderella's Stepsister*. Met while working on the set of Goddess of Fire, and afterward sparked a romance behind the scenes. Their flourishing relationship sparked intense speculation among fans and the media when they were photographed vacationing together in Europe in 2013, eventually prompting confirmation from their representatives. While their love story initially captivated the public and endeared them to countless admirers, the couple ultimately reached a crossroads, choosing to go their separate ways after sharing approximately seven months of cherished moments together. Now that we're almost going to talk about our top three, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share our videos so your friends can learn about these love stories as well. Let us know in the comments another couple that met on set and still have that sparkle of life. 3. Eugene and Ki Taeyong. Eugene and Ki Taeyong. Recognized for their stellar performances in notable dramas like Creating Destiny and Bread, Love and Dreams, initially crossed paths on the set of Creating Destiny in 2009, where they portrayed an on-screen couple. Their on-screen chemistry blossomed into a real-life romance, leading to the start of their relationship. In a genuine and surprise proposal in 2010, Ki Taeyeon proposed to Eugene in a public park, moving her to tears with his romantic gesture. The couple exchanged vows later that year in an intimate ceremony attended by close family and friends. Since then, they have welcomed two daughters into their family and frequently shared updates and photos of their family life on social media platforms. Eugene and Ki Taeyeon continue to support each other's career. Ki Taeyeon made his comeback in the drama Trolley after being off screen for almost three years, and Eugene as a main character in the drama The Penthouse. Two, Yi Son and Yi Bo Young. Yi Son and Yi Bo Young initially crossed paths on the set of 2004 series Save the Last Dance for Me, where they portrayed an on-screen couple. Despite their professional collaboration, their relationship remained platonic at first. Their friendship evolved into romance, culminating in the public confirmation of their relationship and subsequent engagement a year later. In a heartwarming ceremony in 2013, the couple exchanged vows, marking the beginning of their journey as husband and wife. Now parents to two children, they regularly share glimpses of their family life on social media, delighting fans with their enduring love and happiness. Both Yi Bo Yeon and Yi Song continue to excel in the entertainment industry, occasionally gracing the screen in dramas like See You in My 19th Life and Connection, further solidifying their status as a beloved couple, both on and off screen. This couple left a permanent mark on our hearts with their extraordinary bond and unwavering support for one another. Their connection is similar to the timeless elegance of a pair of swans gracefully gliding through the calm waters, their synchronized movements symbolizing an unity that transcends the bounds of time and space. Indeed, the depth of their devotion and mutual admiration is a demonstration to the enduring power of love and partnership. Out.
our top one, Hyun Bin and Son Ye Jin. Hyun Bin and So Ye Jin, celebrated stars in the Korean entertainment industry, captivated audiences worldwide with their remarkable chemistry on screen in the immensely popular drama Crash Landing on You from 2019 to 2020. Their journey towards love began in 2018 when they starred in the movie The Negotiation. Beyond their work, Hyun Bin and Son Ye Jin were often seen enjoying holidays and traveling together, including trips to LA. Following much speculation, the couple finally confirmed their romantic relationship on January 1, 2021, much to the delight of their fans. Their joyous union culminated in a lavish wedding ceremony on March 31, 2021, held at the prestigious Walker Hill Ashton House in Seoul, named the Wedding of the Century. Adding to their happiness, the couple welcomed their first child, a beautiful baby girl, in November 2021. Love often has a way of finding us in the most unexpected of places, catching us off guard and turning our world upside down in the most beautiful way possible. Whether it's a chance encounter in a crowded coffee shop, a fleeting moment shared during a spontaneous adventure, or an unexpected meeting in the middle of our daily routine, love has a knack of defying our expectations and blossoming in the probable of situations. These unexpected encounters remind us that love knows no boundaries and can emerge when we least anticipate it filling our lives with joy, warmth, and the promise of endless possibilities. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching us up until the end. Remember, hit the bell button to receive the notifications for a new stop. Like, follow, and subscribe for more like this. And see you in a new stop.